Hey, camp out junkies. So we in the car, we're going to another lake. And my husband being mean to me. Tell him, tell him, tell him you're being mean to me. You're being mean to me. But because he played Rick Ross, I'm gonna forgive him because I, he know I love Rick Ross. Ain't no competition. When you pull up to the crib, you see the waterfalls. You would think I produce TLC waterfalls. He mean to me. He mean to me. We're playing. It's only type of. He's gonna get messed up. I'm here. I was gonna curse. I don't want to curse. I don't want to sit in here to me. I'm tiptoeing at the bank, hope you don't speak to me. I'm tiptoeing at the bank, hope you don't speak to me. Hope you don't speak to me. You ain't got to say nothing to me on my way out this bank. Where are you going? Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? Tiptoeing at the bank, hope you don't speak to me. Hope you don't speak to me. Hope you don't speak to me. Anyway, we left one um, creek, cause I ain't gonna lie, we felt like we were in danger. Danger! Well, we were scared. They had to pump sunlight in. And it wasn't like sunlight that the beautiful people like. It was what the other people like. Yeah, it was so, we were so deep in the wonderful people country that we both was like, no, we gotta get up out of here. We gotta get up out of here. And it's crazy, because our friends are wonderful people, but being a beautiful person, can't do it. Can't do it. Y'all see the pimpish glasses? Mm. Hey, hey. Nah, but for real, y'all, we were nervous. We had to go. We had to go. I think it was called Piney something, something, something. I don't know. Let me turn it down. But yeah, we were we were nervous as a mug. I'm talking about guys. It was beautiful. You saw the video. It was beautiful. The creek was clear. It had pebbles. No um. No mud or anything like that. It had a little bit of fish flying around, flying, <laughs> um, swimming around. But we just, we just felt really nervous being there. You know, it's just. And I want to be somewhere when I come camping. I want to be at peace. I want to be one with nature. I want to be one with God. I don't want to have to look over my shoulder. I don't want to hope that okay, it was two people over there that disappeared. Or uh, is this going to be deliverance? I ain't got time for that. I ain't got time for deliverance. Not gonna do it. So anyway, we left, and um, the people we're with, they decided that maybe we'll be able to float at um, uh, what's the name of the park? We're going to Montgomery Bell, and I think they have an area that we can um, put the float island in. And we go there all the time to the camp area, but we never go to the water. So we can ready to go see what's happening over there, over there, over there. But yeah, we felt. And what's really crazy, um, we camp out a lot, and my children and our friends always know that we're somewhere at a campground. We never tell them where we're going. So guys, when you on your adventures, hiking or camping or whatever. Start turning your location on on your phone because you don't know what might happen. It might be an accident. It might be something on purpose. I don't know. But I didn't think about it. I didn't even know it exists until my daughter was telling me to turn on my location so she can see where I am at all times. So, yeah, that's what we did. And um, I just feel much better. I feel much better about myself. I feel free. And I feel safe. But yeah. So we out here. We out here. And my husband just bought me these glasses and I feel like a pimp. I feel like a pimp. What y'all got me? We're hungry. We've been riding around for two damn hours. What we got? Food? Bill, say hey to the people. Hey to the people. Yeah, that's the <laughs> motherfucker trying to get us lynched. <laughs> Anyway, woo! That's strong. I love them with everything in me, though. <laughs> we got corn dogs. We got, got corn dogs. Hold on. I don't have any napkins. Are both of these mine, or I only got one? No, you ain't got one. Okay, no problem. I got a corn dog, though.
Your money, your money. Do I have ketchup and mustard? Cool. He's a sweetheart. I was just joking, guys. He, we love him. We love Julian Bill for real. Just joking. It's hot, babe. It's super hot. But yeah, I was just joking, guys. They um. When they saw how uncomfortable we were, we hurried up and got up out of there. But they are sweethearts. I'm talking about that he cooked us some ribs and what else did he cook? Hot dogs. They always have watermelon on deck. No pun intended. But anyway, they always have the sweetest watermelon on deck. But, um, yeah. Always got them silver bullets because that's my fave. I can't have a weekend, a good weekend without silver bullets. I probably could, but I haven't tried. How about that? All right. So, I'm going to eat this corn dog. Holla.